to the city street. Hello, everyone. <laughs> it's Glenda with Shaking Hands Art with Raylan's and my friends out there. I love you guys. I really do. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. And watch to the end because this is an exciting one. At least for me. <laughs> and if you've been watching for very long, I think the improvement will catch you as well. So, why am I talking still? I don't know. <laughs> Let's get busy and paint. Is I'm not going to put a whole lot. But I'm going to put little bits. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted to do. I'll pay it back over that. Some of it may soak into the soil before it goes into the... or come out of the rock. That's going to be enough. There's snow on those, though, too. Well, this one could go this way. That one could, uh, it'll do what it does. <laughs> Try to put one more in here. And that should catch all of it. It's going down to a trickle. All right, I was gonna lighten these clouds up. I might have yet a little bit.
I hope everybody's had a very good week so far and a beautiful weekend. I know I had a wonderful Mother's Day. And I also got to see my granddaughter graduate. Now we only have... I think six, <laughs> five or six to go, but that's, they're stretched out. Once we get there, they'll be bing, bang, bong, but, because they're star, stair steppers, but anyway, we're not there yet. We're not that, and we're not so old that we just can't do it yet, but. That day shall come. A couple of them, we'd be in our 80s by then. Oh my. There is just a thin row of trees and grass at the bottom because there, there would be some soil there and the lake is watering all that. So therefore there is just a small or just one thin stretch of Evergreens there. That's my theory anyway. It's not a forest by any chance. But it's kind of like what you see next to a river. Of course, some of those are big. <laughs> some of those have a lot of them. Anywho, that's how it is on this day in 2024. I do find sometimes being silly just kind of gives me some fun. Joe's been out mowing today. He said one of the irises has bloomed. So we're happy to hear about that. I'm adding a little tiny bit of blue to this because sometimes it makes white water. Did you ever hear your grandmother's or your mother's Speaking of adding bluing to the laundry, to the whites, yeah, it makes your white look whiter. I have a purple shampoo, which <laughs> my grandkids, some people have asked me, do you dye your hair? No, it's just this color of my shampoo. It's got that it takes a lot of that brassiness look and it does leave a little bit of a violet hue in there. <laughs> but it's not real apparent unless I'm in the sun. At least as far as I know. I don't see the top but back of my head very often because I just don't. I figure, I don't know. <laughs> I see, I think they just see things. But no, no, it's true. Blue does make white whiter. For some reason, it just gives that effect of whiter. Okay.
that's it. That's all I'm doing. I don't want to be sorry that I put any birds in there. <laughs> and those are just the simplest of, of painted birds, but... Are you ready? I don't want to climb those mountains, not in my condition, but if any of you want to, if you can find them, <laughs> be my guest, because these are totally fictitious. I will see you Friday. More than likely, you will see Joe in a short tomorrow. There. Hi. <laughs> I'm just making you uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. <laughs> I said uncomfortable. Are you? No. Not too much. What are you doing? Oh, you know what you're saying. Little raspberries out. So I will talk to you later, and I love you. Smile and wave. Give that to somebody else, because that smile is friendly. And that wave is acknowledging. And people need it. They need to know they're seen, and they need to know they've got friendly people around there. And the more people who are out there smiling and waving like we here in Nebraska do, a lot of times it's these, and well, ag country, Kansas too. The farmers wave. Depends on how he's holding the steering wheel. A lot of them it's like this. <laughs> More you want to know, but it's fun. Okay. I hope you like this. I think it's one of my better ones. Next to the study of Aunt Elsie's florals and the peacock. I think I'm this is gonna be one of my favorites. Okay. Behave. A heart speed to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire.